Hello and welcome to our video guide on MLA formatting in Microsoft Word from the Los Angeles Southwest College Library. This video demonstrates how to set up and format your paper using Word 2019 from scratch. Let's get started by opening up Microsoft Word from your computer. Click on blank document. Let's set up the font as a default for the entire document. This will make it easier in the long run. From the Home tab, look in the Font pane and click on the Options button. This is located in the bottom right corner in this area. From the Font menu, select Times New Roman. From the size menu, select 12. Do not make any changes. Leave everything as automatic, no underlining. Do not add any special effects. Click on set as default. Then click on okay. Let's set up the line spacing. Still in the home tab, look in the paragraph pane and click on the options button. In the spacing area, make sure that the before and after spacing is set to zero. Check the box for do not add space between paragraphs of the same style. And under line spacing, select double. Click on set as default. Click on OK. Now let's check on the margins. Go to the Layout tab. Click on Margins. Be sure that Normal is selected and that this is set to one inch all around. Now let's set up the MLA header for your entire document. The MLA header is your last name and the page number on the top right corner of every page in your document. Go to the Insert tab. Go to the header and footer pane and click on page number. Click on top of page, then select plane number three. Now enter your last name and press the space bar. Now click on close header and footer. Now, Microsoft Word will automatically add this information on every one of your pages. Now, let's set up the document's heading. This goes on the first page of your document. Generally, start by typing your first and last name. Press Enter. Now, enter your professor's last name. And then press Enter. Now, enter the course name and number. Press Enter. Enter the date in the day, month, and year format. Then press Enter. Now let's set up the title for this essay. From the Home tab, go to the Paragraph section and click on Center Alignment. Now my cursor is in the center of the page. Enter the title of your essay. Then press Enter. Click on Left Align to move the cursor back to the left margin. Now we can get ready to start typing our paper. Remember to indent each paragraph. Press the Tab key on your keyboard, then start typing your essay. Word has a feature called Word Wrap that automatically pushes the next word down. Finish typing your essay. Insert a page break to start a new section for the Works Cited page. To do so, go to the Insert tab. In the Pages section, click on Page Break. Notice that the cursor is on a fresh new page. Move up the page. From the Home tab, go to the Paragraph area and click on the More Options. Under Indentation, look for the Special menu and select Hanging. Then make sure that the spacing before and after is set to zero points and make sure that line spacing is set to double and make sure that the do not add space between paragraphs of the same style is also checked. 
then click on OK. Now let's title this page. Still in the Home tab, in the Paragraphs section, click on the Center Alignment button and enter the title, which is Works Cited. Press Enter, then click on the Align Left button to move the cursor to the left. Now you are ready to start typing your citations according to MLA style. Keep in mind, if you use a citation generator to create citations, when you copy and paste into the Word document, some of the formatting may be off. So take time to review what you pasted and adjust the formatting. This is an example of a works cited page formatted properly. Each source is in alphabetical order. For more information on MLA style, visit our citation page. And you can do so by going to the college's homepage, which is www.lasc.edu. Scroll down the page and click on the library icon. This takes you to the library's landing page. Scroll down and then click on Library Home, and now you're inside the library's homepage. You can always find citation information on the top navigation bar under Citation. For MLA Style, click on the MLA Style tab. Reach out to your librarians whenever you need assistance with MLA Citation. Thank you for watching our video.